So we've got a conversion kit to convert your normally open mainline four power valve to normally close. So this is called a cassette. What it does is swings open and closes. And that's where we're gonna be installing the body. So step one will be, of course, removing all of your bolts around your valve. You remove all your bolts, R remove your clean out, and pop the lid off. Sometimes the lid is stuck, so you might have to take a, a hammer and use it as a, as a lever, but pop the lid off. Now that you got the valve lid off, you're going to be looking inside of it. Your valve will probably be very dirty inside here. So what we want to do is we want to clean it. To clean it, you're going to take a scouring pad or something and make sure that the valve is nice and clean. As you can see, there's an O-ring here. It's black, so you don't, probably don't see it. But what we want to do is we want to remove that O-ring. So you're going to take a little uh, nail or something and pop that O-ring out of there. Once your valve is clean, we're going to take the cassette. And what we want to do is we want to provide some ABS glue. This is ABS. And what we're going to do is we're going to put the ABS glue on this rim. Just a little bit. You don't need very much. So with your cassette, what you're going to do now is you're going to pop the gate off. The cassette has its own O-ring in the front. It does not have an O-ring in the back, although there is a provision for it. We don't have it on this one because we don't need it. So now that you've got glue on this face here, you're going to probably put a little dab of glue on this face. We want to make sure we don't get any glue on the hinges. This sits in quite nicely. You'll see this will fit right in here. It cradles right into the gate. We do not remove the gate. And we put this against there. Now the two surfaces are going to be glued together because they are touching. They are still not sealed because we had O-ring to O-ring on the other side. So now what you're going to do is you're going to take a rubber glove and you're gonna you're always gonna have a rubber glove but you're gonna take your glove now you're gonna st stick it inside of your glue and I want you to smear it around this uh, the, where the two mating surfaces go and what you want to do is you want to provide a seal there because the seal is not provided from putting a cassette on it's provided in what you do here once you're sure that your seal is done you let it sit for a couple minutes until it sets up once it's set up, you take your gate, you snap it in, and there you are. It's installed. So you can see that's how your gate's going to operate now. So it's in the normally closed position you converted your valve. And pretty well, that's the whole installation. Then you're going to put your lid back on, all the bolts, of course, clean out, and you're done.